254 George Avenue, Carson Section, West Bay. I just wanted to comment on, I just uh, heard, you mentioned this last minute ordinance for a egg and milk check. Apparently you're checking the temperature of the refrigerated units or the cleanliness of the units that these items are stored in. And how could you pass or even consider an ordinance unless you know what the fee's gonna be? That's not right to the small businesses in this city. And I suggest that you stop that right now. Um, I mean, it's, just, it's the first reason. I don't care what it is. Even to bring up a thought like that without discussing the entire details of this um, discussion. Small business is being overwhelmed currently and to even bring up something like this. And we do have a Department of Agriculture in Pennsylvania that should be managing the temperature and the cleanliness of the refrigerated units for those dairy products. I don't think you should be jumping to that conclusion. Small business doesn't need any more problems or expenses. I'm also here this evening to talk about the fact that I read in the paper where um, Mike Merritt, that would be you, you are collecting $23,000 in benefits. Health care, is that correct? From the city taxpayers? Back and forth with this amount. What was that? No back and forth. Oh, I'm not allowed, okay. Well, I just want you to know that there are full-time uh, employees of this city, police officers, firemen, full-time, full-time police, fire, and I assume paramedics, who work full-time and get benefits such as yours. You need to prove to the taxpayers of this city, Mr. Mayor, that you are, in fact, devoting 32.5 hours a week to this job. And furthermore, there is no PA mandate anywhere allowing you to just arbitrarily take $23,000 a year for benefits. And unless you can show it to me, I think you're violating a law which is called theft. Where is it written that the taxpayers have to give you benefits that most people in this city don't even have? You work at Metro. Why don't you get them from your company? Doesn't your company, a union shop, have benefits? Why are we paying for your benefits? And you show me the law that requires you to do this, to even accept it. In this day and age, there's kids right now that are on the CHIP program because their parents cannot afford to give them the benefits that you are providing compliments of us. I'm fair and I want the benefits stopped. I don't believe that the taxpayers of this city should be shouldered with health care, dental, vision, and retirements for part-time elected officials. And until the state legislator creates legislation and there is a mandate that we have to pay it, you are actually violating a law. You're taking money out of the general fund to support your habit that you need health care, compliments of us. And I'm requesting that you voluntarily stop it. And anybody else on this city council that's pulling that off, including the city controller. That's all I have to say. Thank you.